Kilo chola bukepo Bola mafas bukepo Siga makat bukepo Eni mani makona bukepo Kilo chola bukepo Bola mafas bukepo Siga makat bukepo Eni mani makona bukepo This is your boy Black L. My government name is Abraham Khutalang Sebango. The name Black L, in a nutshell, I'm basically the black sheep of the family when it comes to how I do things. Even my skin tone, I'm the darkest. The L represents the loudness for me. So yeah, that's who I am and that's what I represent, that's what I stand for. Manjangilana e Dube, known Guti Dube in New York. Yeah, but first I'm a rapper. Come from 1852. The reason you might be wondering why hip hop is a hip hop la in particular. If you know Splash Jam, the likelihood is that you know we play Sunday. You know we graveside. Young tall. Um, you know Lama hip hop sessions we host to a con. You know we have pro baba pro group, young tall. You know we have tips away, we tips away. Ganjan! So this place has a very important role to play as far as music is concerned because it gave hip hop a voice, or rather local hip hop a voice. What inspired me to be a rapper? Back in the day, I was on Pop TV, because it was a music channel back in the day. So I would see these rappers, your Tupac, your B.I.G. And I wanted to know more, you know. It's crazy how this Mia Park right here has influenced SA, uh, hip hop, in particular, this influenced the culture. Um, it had a very intricate role as far as my interest is concerned comes to the culture. Because I used to see other kids doing it and that's how I ended up becoming part of it. For instance, um, this is where I learned what's a cypher. This is where I learned the vocabulary of the whole hip hop game. What is hip hop, what is rap? This place has changed how I, my view in particular in terms of how I, I looked at the music because I used to be a quite ahead at some point but this is where I fell in love with hip-hop you know because now I was amongst my peers and these are people who were loving what I was in love with and I could relate this is the part that gave me an opportunity to express myself because at the heart of it all hip-hop is an expression We are at Teams Us. Um, this is where the magic happens. This is where we make our music. Teams Us is a household name as far as local music is concerned, having worked with a lot of guys. Even the Khutman, Spuda, Maloya, TKZ has been here. This guy has made a lot of good music. So this is where I to find a voice. This is where I get to express myself. This is where I get to make what, do what I love rather. So yeah, this is my space. This is my world. This is how I move. I do hip hop, I love hip hop, I am hip hop. The reason why I have a very firm uh, relationship with hip hop is not because I didn't grow up listening to other genres, I still do, but hip hop has always taken first preference. And simply because I love poetry, I'm a writer, I've written books, actually, I'm a published author, so. Um, I've always wanted to express myself and growing up I was always an introvert so music gave me an opportunity to express myself, to be on the forefront. That's my relationship with music. So deep that I, it puts me where I need to be, you know. It, it keeps me in line with life. It realizes me from time to time when I lose my path. It reminds me of who I am and what I'm gunning for. So being a better version of yourself, you must know that you're a work in progress, be consistent, work on yourself. Aspire to discover yourself. The, your purpose in life is to find you, to find your own voice, to find your own stance, it's to embrace your own opinions, learn from others, and work on yourself. That's all I can say. I cannot overemphasize working on yourself. This is my 24 Cassie story. What's yours? <laughs> Mali mai kona sa spenda, kona ya mi si tenda